Oh, hello guys. Welcome back to my channel. Another video on my channel. Um, so for today's video, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. But I pretty much say that about like almost every video. Because I do different things. So for today's video, well, let me explain it first, kind of. Um, so as the school year just started like two months ago, um, as some of you may or may not know, I um, just started high school. And at least for my high school, we have to do two years of Spanish. And so I'm doing Spanish this year and then next year. Some people are doing other years, so I'm glad I'm getting it done first and then over with. I mean, I love Spanish and all, but I think it's just my class, my teacher, my in the classroom. But that, that's another issue. So, um, three weeks in, we had, we had to do a project. I know, right? Like, three weeks in? Are you serious? But we had to do a project or whatever. We had, like, um, I think nine options. And one of them was to, like, do a video. Like, a homemade video. And, of course, being the YouTuber that I am, I picked to do the video. And, well, we had to do such and such and include such and such into it. And, well, let's just roll a clip so you can see what I'm talking about. Hola. Just kidding. Hola, me amo Chizubem. Soy de Nigeria y no Mexico. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a story time video. Uh, about the time that I met Cote de Pablo um, in, Ch in Chile. So without further ado, let vamonos with the video. So, most of you may know um, Cote de Pablo from NCIS, and if you don't, she looks a little something like this. Yeah, that's her. Um, and she was also born in Chile. I was in Chile as part of a mission trip with my youth group at church, and um, we went to help equip the Chilean Presbyterian churches and at one of the churches um, was when I bumped, I actually, I bumped into Cote de Pablo. Like literally bumped into her. Our conversation went a little something like this. Oh, hey, hey, Don. Hey, Don. Hey, Don. De Pablo, donde, donde, en si no yes. Me amo, me, me amo, Ah, si, sí, si. Sí. Y mi nombre en es, es en realidad Maria Jose de Pablo. Oh. And then she goes on to tell me about um, how she uh, changed her name to Cote. Um, so she said that um, in, in Chile, if uh, your name is Maria Jose, that um, they call you Cote. Um, and a lot of people don't understand that. I don't even understand that. Um, and um, so she told me how, why she was um, there in Chile instead of, you know, in California. She told me that um, she was on vacation um, with her parents, actually, which is, I think is really great. Um, and she recommended for me that um, while I was there in Chile, that I take a look at some of um, some of Roberto's Roberto Mate's um, work. He is a famous Chilean um, painter, and he I actually took a look at it, and it's like really good. And it's like it's a little like I don't know if it's exotic, but it's like really unique. Um, and she told me that she missed, she actually missed some of the um, authentic Chilean foods there, um, such as clams, oysters, sam salmon, and her favorite snack food, Chilean empa, empa um, I think it was, empa empanadas? Empanadas, that's what it was. It was Chilean empanadas. Um, and... I would love to like actually try that so maybe if I go back to Chile I could actually um, like 
take time out of my day to like try that and do all those things that she wanted she recommended to me which i think um you guys should do too like so if you ever visit chile you should definitely go check out roberto mata's um paintings and go try out that chilling and effort i cannot remember the name empanada empanada empa you know what i mean so <laughs> um so yeah thank you for watching this video hope you got something out of it and goodbye Well, mucho gusto. Me too. Adios. Cuidado. Por qué? Oh, oops, oops, oops. I um, I mean, I mean. Ciao, ciao. <laughs> so yeah, that was a video that I did for my Spanish class. Um, <laughs> it was, it was, I would say amateuristic, amateuristic, if that's a word, that's what I would call it. But, you know, two months later, I have, like, a, a slightly more expanded vocabulary in Spanish, so I'm kind of getting there. I still have, like, a year and the rest of this year, so I'm getting there. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And for you native Spanish speakers or just other Spanish speakers, if you think I did good for being an amateur who's had an... Um, Spanish class like three other years in her life that weren't really as um, sufficient as this one I don't even know what I said what I don't even know how I started the sentence <laughs> but if you guys um, thought that I did well for like an amateur um, please uh, give me some support and hit in the comments down below and um, click that like button. If you'd like to see more videos from me, please um, hit that subscribe button down below also. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you had have a great day. Don't forget to live, love, laugh. Catch you on the flip side. Over and out.